quite a fall you took. Listen, the crane broke down. We have to fly in a replacement, and that will take some time. Go on and explore the area. We'll meet up with you later. Oh, you guys are a bunch of jerks. Come on, really? You don't have, like, rope that you can lower down, guys? Come on. Uh, well, anyway, welcome to, uh, Adventures in Aztec Land, the game, a.k.a. The Ball. All right, this is a first-person uh, puzzle game with uh, some horror elements to it. Uh, we are exploring... Oh, my goodness. Well, it's a good thing we don't seem to take any fall damage in here. Uh, we're exploring this, uh, these Aztec ruins, as it were. This is Mayan ruins. Mayan? Let's see, we're in Mexico. We weren't very clear about where exactly in Mexico we were, but uh, and I'll be honest, um, my knowledge of First Nations uh, cultures in South America is pretty limited. Uh, so, South and Central America, rather. So I apologize if I am incorrectly referring to uh, these guys as Mayans or Incas or, uh, or what have you. Um, but yeah, it uh, looks like we've fallen into uh, a pit uh, that would seem right at home in Tomb Raider. Including some kinds of crazy contraptions. This looks like an Aztec uh, portal gun here. Where's the portal left? Oh, I didn't get to see that. Alright. Um, probably shoot that button. Jump that button. Oh, hey, look at that. So far, it seems pretty much like a, <laughs> you know, excuse for, for a game. Um, I have no clue who I am, or uh, any, there's been no characterization so far. I just found this crazy Aztec weapon, and uh, I'm just, uh, just uh, totally cool picking it up, and I automatically know how to use it. So let's let's go get a rock. Yeah, but wasn't clear already. This is definitely going to be a uh, heavily physics-based game. how the first Tomb Raider game went down as well. Um, although you did get some pretense of meeting Laura and, uh, and Natla. Okay. So this gun is going to help me manipulate the ball around uh, this region. Okay, so, can't break up these pots. No, apparently the 